I need to find the current I naught in this circuit. So 70 and 30, these two are in parallel and 20 and 5 are in parallel. So let's first reduce the, uh, reduce the circuit. So 20 here, 70 and 20, uh, 70 and 30 there and 20 and 5 there. So 70 and 30 is 70 times 30 over 70 plus 30, that's 100. So that's 2100 over 100 is 21 ohms. And this one is uh, 20 time, 20 and 5 in parallel. So 20 times 5 over 20 plus 5, which is 25. So 100 over 25, 4 ohms. So, and that's 200 volts there. So the current, this current is 8 amps because 200 over 21 plus 21 plus 4, that is 25. So I'm just applying Ohm's law there. I would be V over R and R is 21 plus 5, 21 plus 4, that is 25. So anyway, so that gives me 8 uh, amps, which is that. Now this 8 amp, which is coming here, will be uh, distributed in between these two according to the parallel uh, the current divider rule so I will write the rule here 8 70 plus 30 so the current through 70 ohms will be times 30 that is 8 over 100 times 30 which is uh, 2.4 ohms and I 30 will be 8 over 70 plus 30 times 70 which is 5.6 ohms uh, amps sorry these are amperes sorry current these are currents so this is 2.4 amps and this one is 5.6 amps we know these two currents now we need to know these two currents so I 20 that means this the current through the 20 ohms resistance that is the full current here is 8 amps because whatever current is going that way is coming back this way so we know that's 8 amps so 8 there 20 plus 5 times 5 so 8 over 25 times 5 that's 1.6 amps so this one is 1.6 amps and this current is uh, it's not much space here so I will do maybe here so I5 is or to total full current is 8 20 plus 5 times 20 so 8 over 25 times 20 and that one is 6.4 amps so this current now is 6.4 amps so now we know that we know all the currents so we need to find I0 so we can apply KCL at this node or here whatever this current coming current is 2.4 the go outgoing current is incoming current is 2.4 outgoing current is I naught and 1.6 so we can write the KCL at this point let's say this is A so if I do that I will have at node A say 2.4 is coming I naught plus 1.6 is going away so I naught will be 2.6 minus 1.4 which is 0.8 amps or we can write 800 milliamps so this is one and if we write the same KCL at this node let's call it B basically these are the same node though but anyway uh, if we write KCL here we should get the same answer but let's just do it so in this case 5.6 is uh, incoming current I naught is also incoming and 6.4 is outgoing so uh, 5.6 is incoming I naught is incoming and 6.4 is outgoing so if we do it here we will get the same of course we have to and that's what we are getting 6.4 minus 5.6 is again 0.8 that's 800 milliamps so we get the same result there so we know the current uh, this current is 800 milliamps and then if we can find current uh, voltage drop across any of the resistances because we know the 
current uh, through all the resistances and we just multiply by the resistance the respective resistance to find the voltage uh, across each of the resistances so I'm not doing that I'm just and it's not even asked so uh, that's it there